Uh, I, we'll look into it and get back with you. Um, specifically, I'm working with Congress, following up on, on both Julie and Major on, on the meeting, not just the meeting itself, but why not meet with the Republican leaders this week. But you and others are giving this impression the President's ready to work with Republican leaders. But no meeting this week, probably. Instead, he's going out on the road on his own and did this interview with NPR over the holidays where he said, I'm ready to start vetoing a lot more stuff and there's going to be a lot more executive action. So aren't you saying he's going to work with Republicans, but his actions are actually speaking louder than those words? Mm -hmm. Well, Ed, I think uh, the president's action to uh, invite congressional leaders, both Democrats and Republicans, to the White House just a couple of days after the midterm elections uh, and talk about where that common ground is, I do think that that speaks to the president's, the priority that the president places uh, in working with uh, Republicans to make progress for the American people. But uh, you're also right that the fact that the president is uh, going to start the new year by announcing some new executive actions and some new policy proposals that will benefit uh, middle class families uh, indicates that he's most focused on results. He's focus, uh, mostly focused on substantive, substantive policy ideas that will benefit middle class sworn families. In yet, and you're already talking about it. He's moving forward on executive action. He's yeah. going out on the road to go yeah. directly to the American people. He's free to do that, but yeah. he hasn't even been sworn in yet. You're saying he's getting ready to do more executive action? Yeah, uh, he is. Uh, and the president is determined to make progress where he can on his own. Uh, as the president has said many times, particularly in the aftermath of the midterm elections, uh, we can't allow a, you know, a disagreement over one thing to be a, dis a deal breaker over all the others. So uh, I have no doubt that there will be some Republicans who are going to be critical uh, of policy proposals that the president pursues on his own to benefit middle class families. That's, that may be an area where an honest disagreement exists. What we're mostly focused on when we have conversations with Republicans, though, uh, is figuring out where is their common ground? Where, where do we agree? Uh, and the, the disagreements may be more plentiful, uh, but that's all the more reason we should spend a lot of time looking for uh, that area of common ground. And the president uh, uh, will do that. He did that at the end of last year. He'll do it uh, as this year gets underway as well. Last thing Republicans talk.